This is the rundown with Rubio for Thursday, September 26, 2024. Everything happens for a reason. Last night, New York City Mayor Eric Adams got charged with bribery, fraud, and soliciting illegal foreign campaign donations. A lot of the things were like he got upgraded seats and they're saying that he took a lot of this money, stole it from the, the city, whatever. Um, all kind of coincidental. I, mean, I remember there was this beautiful brown bald guy a couple months ago when Eric Adams stood up and said, hey, the border needs to be fixed because we've got all these immigrants coming in, illegal immigrants coming in, and they're going to New York City because we're a sanctuary city. Number one, you said you were in sanctuary city, so you take them. Number two, when you go against the regime of Joey B and Kamala, look what happens. So remember I said he's going to get indicted on something? Well, here we are. There are winners and losers in life. <laughs> the New Yorker magazine, this high uh, published magazine, everyone, ooh, it's high scale, it's upscale, whatever, blah, blah, blah. Uh, new cover. <laughs> As the highest paid female CEO in America, used to be a man. <laughs> so this dude who just transitioned at age 40, all of a sudden is the highest paid female CEO, but it's a dude. Where are the women's rights people on this one? I don't understand if you're pro-woman, you're a feminist movement, why don't you look around and say, hey, no, not even close. Uh, except an embrace. Barstool owner Dave Portnoy, a famous Michigan alum, has say, said at this point on, he will pay up to $3 million per year for a great transfer quarterback to make sure that the Michigan Wolverines are elite contenders. So this is where we are with the NIL at this point. On Monday, we had a UNLV quarterback say he's out because he didn't get his NIL money. And now it's Thursday. We've got Barstool owner Dave Portnoy saying, I'll pay up to $3 million. And you know what? I bet it gets keeps getting worse and worse and worse. Working hard is not enough. <laughs> Diddy's, P. Diddy's lawyer. Okay, so we know how uh, Puff Daddy, P. Diddy, whatever you want to call him, Sean Combs, has been indicted. He's got all these charges, sex slaves, blah, blah, blah. He's had, had these freak offs, these big things. And one of the things was that he had a thousand bottles, bottles of baby oil in his house. His lawyer <laughs> gave a speech yesterday and said the reason why he has a thousand bottles of baby oil is because he lives next to Costco. <laughs> That's awesome. Good, good one, bud. Uh, confidence is the key. El Trumpo has announced that he will be going back to Butler, Pennsylvania, and doing another rally. That remember, Butler is where he got his first assassination attempt. He's going to go back to the exact location where the the first assassination attempt happened, and he's going to have another rally. This guy better have the best security possible, especially on the slanted roof. If you have any questions, you can email Rubio at therubiomethod.com. And don't forget, we've got a live show tonight, 5 p.m. Pacific time. It's going to be on X, YouTube, LinkedIn, and Facebook. Let's get going, gang. Our dedicated staff is ready to work for you. Artbeat specializes in custom apparel. Call us or order online. Free shipping nationwide. Custom printed shirts are our specialty, and we make sure you get exactly what you want. Bring in your own design or let our team create one for you. Promote your business, event, or club with pens, caps, bottles, mugs, and more. Crazy cool since 1985.